we got a lot to talk about, and I want to talk about what's going on in New Jersey, where uh, the governor there, Chris Christie, is unveiling a plan designed to boost the state's failing schools. And Christie says this program, which would allow for uh, for-profit private companies to run public schools. In New Jersey, the governor's office says 100,000 kids are trapped in nearly 200 chronically failing schools. It is unacceptable to me to have children in this city and in other cities across New Jersey continue to be consigned to failure factories that we have neither the will nor the guts to stand up and fight to stop. Every state is in trouble, Joe, and every local school district's in trouble. He made his announcement in Camden, an area known for an extremely poor record of student achievement, with graduation rates not even at 50 percent. And that is why I am proud today to stand with our governor on this issue as we have stood shoulder to shoulder on other issues affecting our urban centers across the state of New Jersey. It is about getting the job done. It is about the public-private partnership that this pilot program can do to transform schools schools and it should and can and it must go forward. It has to go forward because it is about the children at the end of the day. Principal Katrina McCombs of Lanning Elementary in Camden where the governor made his announcement says she is open to anything that helps children. The legislation is expected to be introduced next week. At first no more than five schools would be involved. Now he says that several other states have also tried this so it's time to give it a chance in the Garden State. And Governor Christie says if this law is approved that the companies would still be accountable to the school board. They'll get five years to show what they can do. The state will come in and analyze how things are going to see if it's working out.